Alright, I'm done testing. Okay, so we're going to spray the underside of the trailer. And with the rest of the trailer, I've used this uh, coral seal. Um, which I think gives the best protective coating and converts the rust. some test passes. Make sure we got the flow right. So I set it earlier at 40. Let's see what it does now. Oh, it's way high. Is that the right way? That's 30, right there. God, that wastes a lot of fluid. Let's adjust my spray pattern here. much better. This is all the way open or closed. Not liking this at all. Turn it down closer to 20.
I just had to adjust my flow control on the gun to get a little more material out. Now the first coat of this was done uh, mostly with a brush. You'll see in my other video I did these rails with the uh, actual paint gun. On this Harbor Freight gun, right here, you need to turn that clockwise to get more fluid out. This one right here, I'm pretty sure this is just a stopper for how far you pull the trigger. Ooh, I hit something. back up to the higher pressure again. This flow control, um, pressure regulator is not very good. It's really, really sensitive. And if you hit it, for just a second, It'll mess you up and change the setting. Right now we're running 40 again. This is not too bad. Still getting some coverage I need. Just hope I'm not wasting too much material. I only have a little bit left. Okay. <sighs> 
some of these areas we're probably going to have to hit back with the brush. And I'm pretty sure I laid an ant. Oh crap. I'm really not digging this high pressure. Material. Oh, my hands got me again. Alright, we're definitely running out of material. Let's see what we can spray with what we got left. again. I bent it up there as you can see. This whole side over there, and this whole side right there underneath there. All right, so we're gonna take a break.